You know the best feeling when you go on holiday on the plane across to wherever? That descending feeling when you're coming into land and you finally reach your destination after hours of sat on your bum looking out of a window at 40,000 feet. Well, what happened if you carry on going and you don't actually end up descending and landing right where you should be? That would ring alarm bells, wouldn't it? Well, listen to this one. How do everybody? Welcome back to the channel for a Friday. Hope you're doing all right. I certainly am. Uh, we're uh, at the end of the week, looking forward to the weekend. Let me know what you're going to be up to. And uh, yes, airplanes. You obviously know I deal with airplanes every day of my life, as in taking people to them for their holidays. Yeah, imagine reaching your destination and carrying on flying. This actually happened to the passengers on an Ethiopian airline. Uh, that was on its way to Addis Ababa. You see what actually happened. The uh, the aircraft was supposed to start descending at a predetermined point, and it was at thirty seven thousand feet, and it carried on flying. And yes, it, it it was a bit of a mess. Then all of a sudden, on flight radar, there was a bit of a eh, 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 roly poly turnaround, and in they come. What had actually happened, both pilots, pilot and co-pilot, had fallen asleep. Now, I think, and I may be wrong here, please correct me if I am, uh, I, I do wonder whether sleep is allowed, but one has to stay awake while the other sleeps to monitor all the instruments and all the rest of it. That's what I'm led to believe. I, I may be wrong, but what actually happened, the autopilot on the on the uh, aircraft disconnected and sounded an alarm which woke both of them up now oh shit oh shit what's going on they managed to turn the plane round and land it safely without incident now there's an investigation underway uh, understandably i'm sure both pilots will be fired or disciplined at the very least but somebody's come out and said pilot fatigue not a new thing but you know, it's just lucky, isn't it? They were woken up by that alarm and managed to get get the thing in without incident. Imagine what, what could have happened. Lucky escape, but uh, yeah. <laughs> Let me know if what you think in the comments below. Pretty hair-raising, huh? Anyway, I'll see you later. Toodaloo. Mm -hmm.